Okay, so here we are in Final Cut, and I have created a project called How to Do Stuff. And what I want to do is show you how to do stuff. So I have already put in some things. I've already imported some things. Again, we've talked about that. So file is under import, and you can import media, things like that. So here's a clip that I've put in, and you can kind of see that it's a about a 20-second clip. And let's just talk about some things that we can do here. First of all, this line here is for audio. If I don't want this to be too loud, I can lower this down uh, and do it that way. I can make it louder by adjusting. Zero, zero right in the here in the middle is kind of your basic audio level, okay? Um, I can also get rid of audio or video by going under clip and detaching the audio. What this does is turns it into two separate clips and if I say don't want the audio, I could simply go in here and then hit delete and get rid of it. The next thing I want to do is uh, do some simple things with this. Simple stuff too, just take it. You can go under edit. You can copy. You can paste. Um, you can move them around, okay? You can do a bunch of different things. Let's assume, for example, I want to zoom in and see this video tighter. That is over here. I can take a look at this thing. I can zoom in this video so I can get some to precision. So if I'm moving along, and let's assume I want to cut. So that's under this arrow, and I can go and do a blade. And if I cut, it creates two specific clips, okay? So now I could take this, I can copy it, okay? I can come over here, I can paste, okay? So then what I can do now is play around. I'm gonna come over here, and I can get into playing around with some speed and stuff. So I'm gonna come up under here, I'm gonna to go to modify, I'm gonna to go to retime, and I'm gonna make this go, uh, say, really, really, really fast, okay? And you can see how fast it is. I can change this time to make it go a specific speed, and I can go here, I can go back to modify, I can do retime, I can do uh, reverse clip. Do, it's gonna play, and then it's going to rewind back to where it was at the beginning. I could make a cool loop out of that. Uh, I'm gonna come over here to this clip, and I'm gonna go into my effects. Over here is effects. That's these two rectangles that overlap. And one of the effects that I've already kind of found is called time code. And I'm going to put time code in here. And notice what it does is it creates like a graphic. I can move that graphic around. And notice that the time is in here. Um, I can even edit this. And so if I don't want it to say source, I can make it say rewind or something if I want and put that in. And I can then have it do that thing. So one of the things I could do from that is I can come up over here and I could look for, say, a sound effect um, rewind. So let's say I bring in a graphic, again, back up here under my library, and I'm going to go into stills, and you'll see that I have a variety of stuff that I've downloaded in here in my list. If I go all the way up to the top, I have my Man City logo that I'm going to put in here. One of the things that I can do, for example, is notice that there's these black spaces. I don't like those. So what I'm going to do is add another color, and I'm going to go into the titles, and I'm going to go into backgrounds or elements. I'm going to do solids. I'm going to bring in a custom background, and I'm going to put it underneath. So I'm going to layer it. Now underneath here is this thing. I'm going to double click that because what I want to do with that is I want to change. I went up and clicked here this color. So I click on the black box and I'm going to come over here and grab the ink dropper and I'm going to match the color. Now it makes it look like this is fully across the whole screen. So I'm going to, before I get into the transition, I'm going to take this, I'm going to go back and I'm going to add a different. Um, Another item from the stills, I'm going to add um, a screenshot that I have here. And I'm going to transition from this to this. So I'm going to use like a comic book one, but there's a million different ones I can use. And it'll go and it'll transition from this 
to that using a comic book style, okay? I can play around with the effects of this instead of sliding right. I can see what other options that it has. But there's a ton of different effects. Um, I'm going to come over here for a second. I'm going to do something different with this logo using effects. I'm going to take my Man Center logo and bring it down again on top of this, okay? And I want to crop out all this extra blue. Um, there's a lot of different ways to do it, but if I again go back to effects, I can do the effects here. Uh, I'm going to go to masks, which is here. I'm going to do a shape mask, and I'm going to draw it, put it in here. And notice it does this weird kind of uh, shape. I can come up into this area now, and I can change the, 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 the um, radius, the curvature. I can um, look at this in terms of um, how I want this, the radius of this to work. Um, I can change the X version of it, okay? Notice it's kind of blurry on the edges. I can adjust that to make it a real specific thing that I'm looking for. Um, and then once it's here, now I've got it, I could come over and I've kind of cropped it now. So you can kind of see that it's just kind of just there now. Maybe I don't want it to be this big, so I can go into the middle here and I can do a transform and I can shrink this down, okay? Um, and I can do that here. I can also scale it this way, like I said, and maybe put it in the corner of my picture, okay? Part, what I want to do is actually, I've taken two of the screen recordings I've already done, and I've put them into this project. So now you can see this previous stuff that I talked about is actually in this project. And what I'm going to do now is just, you can see that this is something we just did. So now I'm going to actually go through and just create a title over here at the beginning. And that's the title that I created. So let's just add another title and let's just put it on top of here. So one of the simple things I'll do is I come over here and I go to the titles. And to be honest, I would just not go into these crazy 3D titles for now. Um, I'm just going to take a basic title, as it's called, and just put it over. You're welcome to use any title that you want. But here's this basic title. And let's go through and change some things. First thing, let's make it bigger. Okay. And let's change the words. So how to do stuff. Okay, right now it's all the same font. So what I'm going to do now is kind of speed up a little video and I'm going to essentially do a bunch of things to this. transition on this to kind of wrap this up and I'm just going to use over here I'll just use something like uh, movements and for movements I'm just going to use the flip and I'll just apply it thanks for watching see you next time